it's how y'all doing? Theo here. I wish I could give y'all hugs, but I don't see any kids. Makes me really sad. But I think there's a Bible lesson ready about the birth of Jesus. That's why we celebrate Christmas. Ready? Let's go. Hey guys. So we have a Bible lesson, and it's from Luke 2. It's called One Night in Bethlehem. The king wanted to know how many people were in his kingdom. And Joseph told Mary, we must go to my hometown to be counted, so the king could know how many people were in his kingdom. As Mary touched her large belly, she was pregnant. Oh, but Bethlehem is so far away, Joseph, Mary said. And the baby is due any day now. Joseph said, please don't worry. God will watch over us. There's the little picture of them. Y'all can see that. The trip to Bethlehem was a long and dusty trip. Now remember, they could only walk or ride a donkey. And Bethlehem was crowded. Dro Joseph tried to find a room where they could stay. Sorry, the innkeeper said. Every room here is full. See, there's the little innkeeper telling him that it's full, and she's sad. Little kitty cat. But Mary and Joseph found a warm, clean stable where they kept horses and cows and things. And Mary's baby was born. The baby's boy name was Jesus. And God's angel said... Mary wrapped her newborn baby in clothes to keep him warm. Cloths. See, like the little cloths and Mary and Joseph and their child. A simple feeding box under the stairs is what he laid in one night in Bethlehem. So that wraps it up for our story. Now I'm pretty sure all the puppets in there might have a show. I'll have to go ask him. Let's go. walk. Oh, I'm so pooped. Oh, that lady with the big belly had to, I had to carry her this entire way. And what is that little thing doing in my feeding trough? I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to be there. Unless it's food. Let me go check. That's not food. That's a little lady. That's, that's a little man. What? What? I know, right? I'm pretty mad. I wish there was food in the trough. There's not. It's just a baby. <clears throat> wish it wasn't. <clears throat> well, Mr. Uh, Horsey, that's, uh, that's fine. It's a little baby. His name is Jesus. Jesus? What is Jesus? You know, from God, our creator. You know God. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know him. Yeah, yeah. We sing and praise him, right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. All right. That's cool. Wow, he was born right here in my feeding trough? I'm pretty sure it's my feeding trough and not yours. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's mine. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye-bye, <sighs> Mr. Donkey. Bye-bye. Hey, guys. So it looks like those puppets sure did have a good time. They were arguing over a feeding trough. I'm pretty sure it was the horses, though. All right, so I'm going to say a prayer right now. If you have any prayer requests, feel free to pray along with me. So let's bow our head, close our eyes. Father, in the name of Jesus, God, we come to you right now, God, thanking you every day for all your many blessings and your Savior that has been born on this day so many years ago, God. We just ask that you watch over us and keep your hedge of protection around us this Christmas season, God. Let us get plenty of gifts from Santa. Also, we just want to thank you for all your many blessings, God. And just, I can't explain how much we love you and we give you praise. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I hope to see you all again next year. Bye-bye.